We're here at Horsham for the club's biggest day of the year, but it's not all about the Horsham Cup. With three other features boasting almost $30,000 in prize money, we kicked off with the Vic Red Maiden Final, won by Mark's Boy, who was trained by Sandra Galea. Racing. Mark's boy out cleanly from the inside. Brazen Blue had early speed and they'll share it initially. Getting through to third now, Sarah Swift in Enola Gay who goes around to her. A length away to Menindi, Sunset Oasis, then Rising Storm. Proven Eddie brought up the rear on the swing. Brazen Blue, a narrow leader. Mark's boy's persisting for the rail and getting it. Mark's boy now drove the fence, took the lead from Brazen Blue. And Mark's boy, a big win in the Vic Breeders, won by a length and a half to Brazen Blue. Yeah, I was confident with the red actually when, when I seen the box draw. Um, he wanted to be, he likes the fence and a bit of luck come his way today. So, box one with Maiden's young dogs, you know, there was a bit of trouble in the race and, like I said, a bit of luck come our way. Now, what do you think the future's like for Mark's boy? Yeah, he's a handy dog. I wouldn't say he's a champion, but he's just a nice handy dog. Racing. Shared bonus out quickly from the centre. Big bad Fiji had speed, but shared bonus straight up on his outside to cross and lead. They're out by three lengths over Squirto. Getting up near the inside, Chief Mingo. Then Bill's back, Hollywood Jones, Alpha Hermes, Jackie Baxter. On the swing though, and shared bonus zip right away here. Six in front to Squirto, then Big Bad Fiji, but shared bonus is going to romp in. Shared bonus by seven lengths over Squirto. Third Big Bad Fiji. Yeah, I Raced here a few times over the 410 and showing a lot of pace and strength over the 410. Expected a good run from today and to prove that. I imagine it's pretty special handling on Horsham Cup Day. What are your thoughts on that? Yeah, it's been a great day out here. Great sun, great weather, and there's a good crowd turn up. It's been good. Racing. Cutting Edge out fairly, winning at Diva's Shadow, sprung out to lead over Cutting Edge who got straight to second a length away. They're two in front to Brazen Bomber, then Win Whistler not far away now getting the inside run. Wide out Texas Titan from By the Gallon, Baltic Charm at the rear. Off the back down, getting through Cutting Edge had taken the lead. Win Whistler though got into a stalking spot two lengths away, then Diva's Shadow, Brazen Bomber and Texas Titan. On the swing, cutting edge in front, but Win Whistler looming large. Went up now, Diva Shadow starting to respond, but cutting edge is staving them all off here. Cutting edge, a tough win, one a length and a quarter, Diva Shadow. Jeff, you started favourite from box four. Was that a worry at all coming into the race? A box four was. Starting favourite didn't matter to me or the dogs. Just box four, I just hoped he got out of trouble early, Molly. I thought Win Whistler was too close, and I was a bit worried there, but uh, I haven't seen the replay, so I don't know what happened in the straight, but he seems like he guts it out pretty well, so. Uh, real, real happy, especially the fact that when Whistler was so close off the back, you know. So. Now Horsham have put on a $2,000 bonus for this race, so that's an extra $1,400 in your pocket. It's a great initiative by Horsham. What do you think about it? Oh, I think it's great. The distance racing, so I love the distance racing, and uh, I'm hoping this bloke can stay. So I hope there's some more around. You. <laughs>